In a series of stories we call The Rebound, we're following the progress of people all over Utah as they respond to the challenges of COVID-19, and some of them are business owners. In fact, in downtown Salt Lake City, stores can legally reopen now, although Mayor Mendenhall is asking owners to hold off for longer if they can. One business that is not waiting is McKay Diamonds. There's something special about jewelry because we love what I do, you know. At a little more than seven feet wide and 50 feet long, McKay Diamonds is one of Salt Lake City's smallest stores. There is so much history here. Thank you. Yeah, 70 years already. <laughs> 70 years? Yeah. Photos of couples who bought their wedding rings here some decades ago line the walls of this true mom and pop shop. Everything together, we're fine with that, you know. Joaquin and Sandra Andrade bought the business more than a decade ago. They take pride in tending to its traditions, which were interrupted by COVID-19. You are in downtown Salt Lake City on Main Street, one of the busiest high traffic areas in our state. What happened to the foot traffic that oh, used to go past here. a ghost town. A ghost town. We <laughs> come in here like see. three, four times, you know, I say, there is nobody over there. The whole, you know, you can go naked on the street. There is nobody. <laughs> the shop was closed for 35 days. Today, we, we decide to reopen the business. But they're open again. Thank you so much, man. Truly appreciate me. Salt Lake County has eased restrictions, allowing more businesses to resume. We're not afraid. Though Salt Lake City Mayor Aaron Mendenhall is encouraging non-essential businesses to remain closed as long as they can. We cannot stay home. We need to make the money we need, because of the bills to come in, the rent we have to pay. The Androds did qualify for federal funds in the form of the payroll protection program to help ease financial burdens. They could stay closed and get paychecks until June 30th but they'd rather open the shop sooner than later. Just go to work <laughs> and take care of yourself. <laughs> they try to take care of others too. We sterilize doors, countertops, even the rings people try, we sterilize. The Androds are originally from Brazil and this seven foot wide slice of Salt Lake City is all the space they need for their American dream. The American dream is not coming here, have a big house, a big car, it's the liberty people have here. There's a lot of things I do in silver. The liberty we have here, we cannot buy anywhere. It's not cowards live in the cave, afraid to go out. You can see people are anxious to go back, work, you know. America is not weak like they think. We are very strong. I feel people will come out. And we will keep checking in with Joaquin and Sandra and other local business owners as we all rebound from the COVID-19 pandemic.